Hi, this is Gareth Kentish and today's video is to firstly show you how to download the sample CD stuff file from within the list money generator program and then secondly uh, extract that file onto a folder onto your local computer and followed then by the option to upload that file onto a folder onto your web hosted account that's after you've made the adjustments using and a HTML editor to suit your own particular requirements. So first things first, let's download this file from within the List Money Generator program. And a note of caution, it is a fairly large file being 47 megabytes. So it might take between five and 10 minutes to download depending on your connectivity. So I'm gonna download the folder by clicking this link here. And you'll then notice a little icon pop up at the bottom left hand side of the screen, just giving you an indication of the progress of that file being downloaded. Now I'm going to assume the file has already been downloaded due to the size and I'm going to check that by looking at my Explorer program. So let's just do that. And you'll see that it should be downloaded into your downloads folder. And you can see here I have a zip file called sample CD stuff. I'm going to click on that folder because what I want to do is extract it to a folder on my local computer. So click on the folder here and then click the extract button at the top. I'm going to click on a folder that I know sits on my local computer, Partnerships to Success is a good example. I'm going to click on my Auction Money Generator 2 and you can see here that I've already created a folder called Sample CD Stuff. Happy with that. Click OK. It's already been there done before but I'll just go yes and now that file has been extracted to my local computer. I can now then go into the editor and make the adjustments to the HTML files just to suit my own requirements. Now assuming that's been done, I can then load that onto my folder, onto my web hosting account, and the ideal program to do that is filezilla.com, which is free and downloadable from the web. So I'm going to show you filezilla.com, just click on the icon here, and you'll see here that it works in two parts. Firstly, FileZilla looks at your local computer, and you can see here that it's looking at my C um, file here, C drive, and it can see the sample CD stuff folder here. But if I then type in the name of my hosted account on the web, which is etalbar.com, which is what I'm going to do now, type in my username and password, it should then connect to my folder on the um, on the web, which it has done. And the file that I'm going to store it in is under etailbar.com. So I'm going to find that under public HTML under this folder. Then I should find the folder etailbar.com, which is here. Let's move that down. There it is. Click on that. And then I'm going to click on the folder here. And you can see I've already created a folder called samplecd.com, so I'm happy with that. There it is. And then what I'm going to do, do is I'm going to find the files that have been extracted to my local computer, and there they all are. I've just selected all those fi files, and now I'm going to just move them across to the folder here. If I let go of my left-hand side of the mouse, it's now going to upload all those files onto that folder on my web hosted account. Now, I hope that's been helpful. My name's Gareth Kentish and thank you for watching.